what a makeup mandy coming at you with another makeup tutorial but you know what i'm actually not going to talk about the makeup this time i get like bored of talking about it okay i'll list everything below and kind of do like a bailey sarian thing where like yeah if you want to know the information about that it'll be listed somewhere but i'm going to talk about something different so i was going to actually talk about how i make money and get a lot of free stuff online through literally just making videos or using doing like affiliate marketing so a lot of my friends have asked me like oh how do you get all this stuff well at first i started by literally just posting mostly i think it was it's like instagram where you post what you're wearing you know your outfit of the day your makeup whatever your kids toys anything and tag the brand the store that you got said product from and do that for every day honestly be consistent do it as much as you can anytime you're posting literally try to make sure you tag even walmart dude i don't i don't care i don't have no shame over here in my game like i had tagged walmart and amazon probably the most and if you show a pattern of you consistently first of all posting on social media and then you show a consistent pattern of you tagging companies other companies notice that and you'll start getting traffic of emails or anything dms through instagram or anything of companies kind of asking you like hey oh my god i love your content um we would love it if you would showcase this makeup or we sell sweaters uh you know if if you're willing to make a video uh, a reel of at least 15 seconds and three pictures of you with this content will give it to you for free now of course you might think wow that's kind of a lot to do for like a free gift that may have been like $20 but you have to start somewhere so I started doing that originally like you know I'd be like okay first make sure that they're not scams a lot of the times they're not they might be companies from China that are selling through Amazon that is definitely real and that's not the worst thing you know what I'm saying like make sure they're legit usually if their page has a good amount of followers a little bit of engagement if they're selling through Amazon honestly I would pretty I don't want to say I would pretty much trust it I've never had an issue with that because Amazon's gonna have your back either way you know they make so much money if they have to send you money back or something because of fraud they will but again i've never had that issue ever um i have had amazon sellers like i guess give me money through paypal to buy their product on amazon and then for you to get the product make sure you really like the product okay i'm not just gonna give the review because they gave me the money to buy the product to give the review you understand like i'm sure that's what they're trying to do but i've made it very clear with these companies whenever we're talking and negotiating our contract or whatever the agreement that you know i have to really like the product and odds are i will <laughs> i'm not really picky at all when it comes to any of that like free stuff bet <laughs> i'm gonna rock it we're gonna play with it you know whatever so there's that like you know so yes there is chinese companies through amazon but odds are you're gonna get your stuff you're gonna get your free stuff you're gonna get your money and then you start doing that for a little bit okay you start getting some momentum because now you're creating content that shows you are showcasing content wearing clothes you know most of mine are makeup related clothes related which is kind of what i was doing anyways so now you're gaining momentum now you're you're kind of you have more content to make because companies are giving you stuff that they want you to showcase so it kind of you know not a double-edged sword you know it's the the best of both worlds you're giving me you're giving me content and you're giving me stuff then once you actually kind of have it going on like i'm still like a micro influencer i guess you know i'm i'm still such a small fish in a huge pond a lot of my friends and followers and 
everything. You guys have seen I've been doing this for a long time. And it looks like I haven't really got anywhere. And you're pretty much right, you know? Like, even YouTube, I'm starting to really climb. Like, I have, like, over a thousand subscribers and stuff now. Which, YouTube's the hardest, just so you know, to get subscribers and followers. So, I look at that as the real, oh my god, I'm really doing it. And it's because... Honestly, it was like two to three weeks. I was just posting every day, every day. I really started growing when I was doing that. So I I really want to get better. And that's, that's really the point too is post your content. Post it. Post it every day. I know what you guys are doing. A bunch of nothing. And you can be recording it. Like me right now doing all this makeup on my face to look cute. Okay. All right. I don't really do my makeup that much anymore. But you know what? two, three times a month, I'm looking real fly, I can make a couple videos out of that. Or I'm a stay-at-home mom. I make a lot of videos about that. You know, so just keep up the content. But back at the ranch, you can make money doing it. So keep up your content, post what you're doing, tag companies, tag products, tag anything you can. And also when it comes to networking, I tried to make sure, like this Valentine's Day event that I went to recently, I, you know, I was really just kind of hanging out with some girlfriends, having a good time. But I also, whenever I made the video to try to push in a little bit of detail about Constance, the girl who hosted it, and what she's doing, you know, mortgages, like those little dumb things that you don't even think about or you don't even feel as important or valid it is because now you're spreading out your friends names you've made content kind of for both of you my friend rosa we do a lot of things together or she gives me a lot of gifts and food so whenever i make gifts or make videos for her you know it's just it's just keep putting your name out there people will keep seeing it and it will stick in their mind and any exposure is good exposure. So that's really it. Just keep exposing yourself. Keep making the content. Tag, hashtag, all that stuff. Like, I know I've seen a couple of things that are like, oh, hashtags are like meh, begging for attention or like thirsty. No, okay, like they're relevant. It's, you know, they're there for a reason. They're there to help get the followers and the people that you want to see your content to see it. So, you know, whether I'm making a video about motherhood or fashion or anything, you know, I try to make sure the hashtags are connected to whatever content I am making. Also, don't mind me shivering. I'm outside because it's the only place that's quiet because these kids, you know, <laughs> you know how it is, mamas. But, um, yes. So, post your content, tag it, and you're going to keep getting that momentum, baby. You know how much free stuff I have gotten? Thousands of dollars of free stuff. Literally. Thousands of free stuff. And... I'm going to keep it coming, okay? And eventually, you can start asking for money because, yeah, I'm worth it now, baby. Once you start making money, it's all up from there, baby. <laughs>